Good afternoon and welcome back to another Rush Gang fishing episode. Just down the beach this afternoon with my mate Angus, flicking around a couple of big rods and hopefully we can score ourselves a big old slob tonight. Sun's just making its way down now, we've got the burley out, a couple of big baits out. I got fresh mullet, fresh tailor, fresh pilchards, got a good mixture of baits here. Fingers crossed as that sun sets, a couple of big fish come through. Yeah, we sort of arrived a bit later than planned, so we're sort of rushing around like mad. Um, sun's just coming down now. Ideally, we would have been a bit more organised, but it's all good. We've got the burly bag in the water. The rods are out. It's just feeling a bit rush rush at the moment to try to beat the sunset. Should be a good night. Hopefully a few fish show up. It's pretty stunning conditions, actually. There's a little bit of a breeze, but it's offshore, so it's not too bad. Wind behind our backs making it pretty easy to cast, so yeah. Hopefully a few tailors show up and then into the dark, hopefully a few mulloway or something. So before it gets dark, I'll quickly show you the gear I'm using. That's just a 6,000 size Saragossa with 30 pound braid on the Assassin Bluefish rod. That rod there is set up for tailor ideally. On my other rod I've got the big, the big old pen prevail, 10,000 size Saragossa. And that thing will stop pretty much anything. So. I might get the drone up, have a quick look around before it's dark. And I'm gonna do is chuck big mullet fillets out on one rod, pilchards on the other. So one sort of set up for Taylor, the other one set up for Mulloway and bigger things. Check out the moon, it's going to be a stunning night. Slow start, but it's an absolutely stunning night. So the sun's just sort of setting now. Have to get the glow sticks out on the tips of the rod soon. We're just going to chill back, put a few hours in into the dark and hopefully something massive comes through. It's the plan. It's been really quiet, it's wicked sunset and it's been too dry. Lots and lots of pickers around, so now they've all seemed to bug it off, which is good. Fish? Nah. I think I've finally had something to eat my bait here. It's not doing anything, so I don't think it's anything very special. Or is it just seaweed? It's 
It is. <laughs> shovel nose. The baby shovel. First fish of the night. Holy hell. There you go. Three hours or so of fishing, and that's all we've caught so far. Little shovel. And he wasn't even hooked in the mouth, he was foul hooked, so. Been a very quiet night, but we'll give it a couple more hours and surely something's got to show up sooner or later. Finally got something on here. It has been such a slow night. It's not pulling any string, but it's got a bit of weight. Yeah, it's definitely something on now. Turn your light off. It's been a super relaxing night down the beach, but fishing wise, it's just been dead. I don't know what this is. It's sort of like trying to run, but it doesn't quite have enough weight. I reckon we've been sat here like four or five hours now. It's been tough. I just want to see the fish. I don't even care what it is. Through a bit of weed, maybe. Yeah. What is it? Baby stingo, is it? Another oh. shovel. Oh no. That's what that other guy was saying. I thought. Little banjo shark. Gee. Oh, another little critter for the night. Very, very tough nights fishing, but at least, I don't know, it's better than nothing, I guess. Pretty cool looking creature. We'll chuck him back. videos on this channel or if I should just scrap it and get rid of it but yeah we had fun anyway it was a pretty wicked night down there so yeah if you like this one don't forget to like comment and subscribe and we'll see you on the next one